While I was down visiting Trevor, we decided to have some fun and do something semi-scientific. So we decided to investigate what the airflow was in one of Trevor's new patent trailers, meaning that this is the only trailer he has of this kind. And we wanted to see, you know, can we improve it more? This is by no means a scientific study and it should be taken with a grain of salt. But we had a question and we had a way to get an answer. Now, one of the things we noticed as soon as we got on the highway was that the streamers were actually flowing outside of the vehicle. And that's not what we thought would happen. We both theorized that the air would come in through the front and leave out the back. It looks like the air is coming in the back and going out the front. And so with that information, I asked Trevor what he's going to do with it. You know, we put the science and technology to trying to keep these animals comfortable while they're being traveled, while they're being transported. And I think we have, we've learned some stuff today that we can improve. We're gonna have to do some head scratching. And the best part is, I know from experience with working on those dog houses, the trailer manufacturers are interested in engineering these trailers to be better to transport livestock. Well, guys, we got one question answered and we came up with a whole new list of questions from our semi-scientific study. Again, Trevor helped us design a fabulous infographic on driving safely around livestock trailers and how you can improve livestock welfare while you're driving on the road. Until then, think of some more questions you'd like to ask us here at Alberta Farm Animal Care and we'll try to answer.